as a health aide for hospice, um, we go into people's homes, we do their personal care, we can also help do household chores, and we give our patients the dignity that they deserve. Being clean and just that little bit of extra touch just gives them a dignity and comfort that sometimes with what they're going through, with anxiety, sometimes with what's in the home, the situation with their what they're going through, just that little bit of extra is what we're able to give them. And it just gives them a comfort that they need at this time in their life. Because just knowing that you're on hospice, they're afraid, they're scared. Just somebody that's there to comfort them, to help them, to make them feel better, just makes the biggest difference in the world. A lot of people don't want their family members. They're, they feel more comfortable with us helping them do personal care than they would a family member. And some family members don't feel comfortable. A child doesn't want to give their dad or their mom a bath if they don't have to. We're taking that, I, I'm not even going to say a burden, just that task off their family member because it's an important thing and it just makes someone feel better. And to me, making someone feel better, I don't care if it's a smile, if it's holding your hand, if it's curling your hair, just those things are so important. Shaving someone, most of our gentlemen of the older generation shaved every day. Some people don't feel comfortable shaving someone else. Just giving them that little bit of normalcy, just to make them feel better. It makes such a big difference. We never wanna take anyone's independence away. We just wanna be that little bit of extra help. If they're still able to do things, we just wanna be the ones that help them do those things to keep their independence as long as they can, because that's one thing that they're still grasping for. So as far as being independent, they, you know, let them still walk to the bathroom if that helps them. If they can do everything but washing their back or things like that, just let them still have that, but give them that little extra help they need. Um, if it means washing someone's hair and curling it, or, you know, helping them get ready for just a grandchild to come over and visit or something like that. It's just that little extra personal touch. And if it's just running the sweeper, if that helps them after you give them their bath and things like that, or fixing a meal, as long as it's on our care plans and we got the orders for it, we do what we can to give them that, that sense of security and dignity. And it's very important when you know that your time is near.